Hey guys, Bloomister here, and today Hypixel did a spooky event update thing. They had new spooky mobs, they added two new reforged stones, three new talismans, a new helmet, changed the bat pet's ability, and a ton of other stuff that I'm gonna go over soon. Let's first go over the spooky mobs. I've seen five mobs in the spooky event so far. There might be more that I haven't seen, I'm not sure. The five mobs I've seen are Wither Gourds. I'm pretty sure these are the most common. Scary Jerrys, Trick or Treaters, Phantom Things, I, I forgot the names, and uh, Wraiths. Wither Gourds are the most common and throw exploding pumpkins at you. Scary Jerrys build aspect of the Jerrys and have a chance to double attack you so they basically deal two times the damage they normally would. Trick or treaters are just baby zombies in costumes. Phantom things, uh, I, I forgot what they're called again. They just turn into a clone of you and they just look like you and that's pretty much it. They're not really they're not really very interesting. And I'm pretty sure rates are the rarest. I only saw them in the last 20 minutes of the spooky event. They might be like a special mob or something. I'm not sure because of it, it's been like an hour. Okay, I have no idea what this event is. But yeah, I'm pretty sure they're like a special mob or something. I'm not sure yet. And there are also witches. You get them from like trick or treat things, but I'll talk about this later. The next thing on this list is the new helmet they added. The new helmet is called the witch mask, which basically allows you to summon like two bat minion things. And they both fight things and attack things for you. And I'm pretty sure it drops into witches I talked about earlier, but uh, I'm not sure because again, it just came out like 40 minutes ago. They also added like a combination thing of the vampire mask and the witch mask, so it's like a vampire witch helmet or something. And it basically has both the abilities uh, from both of the, the things, so yeah, that's pretty cool. After that, we have the three new talismans the bat person talisman, the bat person ring, and the bat person artifact. And they just make the witch mask stronger, so th yeah, that's pretty much it. We have the Bat Pet's new ability, it's called Wings of Steel. It basically makes your attacks on spooky mobs like, stronger. Also, I'm pretty sure I didn't mention this before, but spooky mobs only take one damage when you hit them. So like, you just have to keep hitting them until they die, it's like really annoying. They also added some new reforged stones called Candy Corn and Rock Candy. I'm not sure what they do, but I'm pretty sure that they increase the amount of candy that you get from the spooky festival by like a percentage or something but i'm not sure and at last we have the spooky weapons the blasto lantern the pumpkin launcher and the ghoul buster and they basically just allow you to deal two damage to these things instead of one damage it, it's like the season of jerry thing where the, the mag pews are there and you have to shoot them with the frosty the snowman thing it's basically that so like the blasto lan lantern is the the snowballs the pumpkin launcher is the frosty the snowman head thing and the ghoul buster is just a weapon that you can stab mobs with it's just like instead of dealing one damage when you attack them they deal two damage also, I don't think I mentioned this before, but you can't use ranged projectiles on the zombies and mobs, the, the spooky mobs. They're immune to ranged projectiles, so you have to go ahead and stab them, so I guess that's why these would be useful, but blasto lanterns don't come back, so you just lose them. So I, I don't know how worth it it would be to use blasto lanterns on these. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much the entire new spooky festival in a nutshell. They added a bunch of new stuff that I literally have no idea on how to use, because it came back. It came out like an hour ago. I, I I don't know how to use any of these things yet. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that some big brain people figure out some great uses for these weapon things. So um, yeah, I guess 